hello friends welcome to my channel this is Charan in this video I will show you how to show and hide the jQuery dialog box with checkbox control using jQuery so after reloading the browser now I am selecting the checkbox control see the jQuery dialog box has disappeared it's hide now I am unselecting the checkbox control if I want to hide I am selecting to show I am unselecting that's it if you are a first time visitor to my channel, please subscribe to get the latest updates. I am using Notepad++ for this video tutorial. Right now in this Notepad++ contains a simple HTML code with some header tags H1, H2 and horizontal line. Now after the horizontal line, I am adding the input checkbox element. Input type is equal to checkbox and id is equals to show hide is a checkbox id i am closing the checkbox control select the checkbox to show hide the jquery dialog now after the checkbox control i am adding a do control I am closing this do control inside this do I am adding some text like for example I am taking this text that's it up to now we have just finished the designing part now before adding the jQuery functionality to show and hide the jQuery dialog box let's save this file first we'll check the basic output how it looks the designing part on the browser and this is the output of that code which contains right now header tags and this is a checkbox control and the below it is a div control with some text now my first target is I want to make this div container into a jQuery dialog box so for that we require the jQuery CDN links let's search for jQuery latest CDN Google And from the search results, I'm selecting the hosted libraries. In the Google hosted libraries, at the corner, there is a contents panel which contains a jQuery and jQuery UI. First, I'm selecting the jQuery. In jQuery CDNs, you can find different versions of CDN links. I'm selecting the version 3.3.1. Let's copy this part and paste in our header section. After that I require the jQuery UI also select that one in the jQuery UI there is two snippets one for the CSS style sheet and the second one is the jQuery UI dot min dot js let's copy this both okay, huh? now after adding the CDN links now script closing the script tag inside the script the first part I want to make this do container into a jQuery dialog so let's add this id is equals to jdo is the id of the do container in the script dollar function between single quotes I am adding the ID of this div when we are adding IDs we need to prefix with hash div ID dot dialog that's it we have added a functionality to this div container to show the jQuery dialog box let's save this file we we'll check the output I'm reloading the browser and notice we got a new result the due tag is become now a jQuery dialog box now my next target is when I select the checkbox I want to hide this jQuery dialog box when I unselect I want to show the jQuery dialog box 
Let's add the functionality. In the above script, I'm adding another function. Now in this function, I'm adding the text box. Now in this function, I'm adding the checkbox control ID. Dollar, single quote, double quote, between single quotes, hash, checkbox dot. When I click the checkbox control, so I'm adding the click function. If dollar this dot is colon check if the checkbox is checked I want to close this do tag dollar put in double quotes hash the do tag ID dot dialog between single quotes I'm adding the close property else in the else part if I uncheck I want to show the jQuery dialog box so instead of writing this part I'm adding here I'm deleting the close I'm adding open that's it let's save the file We'll check the results on the browser. I'm reloading the browser. So after reloading the browser, now I'm selecting the checkbox control. See the jQuery dialog box has disappeared. It's hide. Now I'm unselecting the checkbox control. If I want to hide, I'm selecting. To show, I'm unselecting. That's it.